How Hydroloop Works The processor treatment tank is in the middle behind a stainless steel front plate. A patented combination of six treatment technologies is what we use to clean the water. Now, water enters the Hydroloop system from the top via a 40mm connection. The first treatment we use is sedimentation, so sediment is collected at the bottom of the processor tank and wasted automatically to the sewer. Flotation. All floating dirt, like soap and hair, is trapped and collected in the middle tank and thrown away automatically via the skimmer to the sewer. And then we inject millions of air bubbles and we have dissolved air flotation. So these tiny air bubbles, they travel upwards in the center tank and they collect the suspended solids and organic matters and this way it is removed out of the water via the skimmer. We have soap in the water and we use this, it's called foam fractionation. So soap, shampoo, hair conditioner, solids and organic matter are actually lifted out of the water and skimmed off by the skimmer and wasted automatically to the sewer. In the outer tank we have an MBBR and this is a biological treatment by aerobic bioreactor in the outside upper tank. And then the final step is the UV disinfection. And we take the water from the upper tank, it is transferred to the lower tank, passing a UV light. Now in the lower tank, the stored water will pass the UV light every four hours again and is re-disinfected. Below the processor tank, behind the stainless steel front plate, is the distribution center. A powerful, low noise water pump distributes via standard half-inch connections the reused water to the toilets, the washing machine, and valve controlled to the garden or the swimming pool. Hydroloop uses no filters or membranes, so the system cannot clock. The system is self-cleaning by timed rinsing and removes waste sediment and sludge to the sewer all automatically. The overflow and the waste output leave the system via a 40mm outflow. And the mains water backup, which can also be a rainwater, but it is a backup system, is connected via an air gap according to EN13077 and is certified by Kiva.